What's up, everybody? The CEO, the money maker, the one and only storm taker, baby. And I'm back with another mother loving video, guys. I know you already saw the title, guys, but this is six new magic items that could be added to Clash of Clans in a future update. Shout out to this guy on Reddit. This is where I got all my information from. Go drop them some love. You know, go check out the original post, guys. Links down in the description, guys. I'm telling you the number one magic item on this list would be crazy and i think they need to add this to the game guys so without further ado without a talking without a walking smash 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 that damn mother loving live button that live button baby and make sure you subscribe turn that bell on i'm gonna turn that shell on i'm gonna come look for your mom on bro you know how it is you know how it is let's jump on into the video without no further talking let's go number six baby so number six, we got trading coins, scarce and precious. This priceless coin can be presented to the trader to purchase anything from his shop, excluding items um, purchasable, purchasable during events. So what I got from this guys is basically a, a coin, a real coin, like a book uh, that can be used to purchase anything in the trading shop. I like this idea because um you'll find it really valuable getting a hold of this coin but also you cannot use it to purchase rare events like special time events like the golden like the giant gauntlet and uh, hero equipment you won't be able to use it to do that because that would be too broken too overpowered so this is a real balance guys and that's why i think it's coming in at number six we got a capacity to only bring two of them all right guys so, so next up on the list we have the number five guys we got the chief key this is a really interesting one guys i think this will definitely deserve a re rework but i do like the idea uh the concept so it's a mystery it came from mysterious origin this is a key or armor really rare unlocks like two boosts that's what i understand guys you can either use in our own village or uh, builder base guys so you can either unlock uh builder boost with resource boost for 12 hours you can unlock either training boost uh with hero boost or something like that guys so it's basically a key that you'll get two boosts but for 12 hours and i do love this idea because when i'm doing trophy pushes guys i have to constantly be using training potions i wish there was a way for me to get more boosts but make it more rare even put it in the um the league metal shop guys making it way more expensive than other material guys i love this ability to be able to get that 12 hour boots for when i'm grinding in clash of clans with po with training potions so this is a very nice one for me guys and that's why i put it at number five coming in at number four numero dos that's two i know the, the shield potion maximum capacity of three um and it is what it states guys sourced by fellow villagers this strong elixir adds three hours of shield to the home village guard does not occur after this shield i do feel like there could be more hours probably increase the hours from three to six hours and this is for guys that are doing trophy pushes doing challenges that don't want to lose their loot I, th I think having that six hour uh, pop one of these potions after each season has ended would be pretty good. So you get to keep that loot that you get from the um, gold, gold pass. So, uh, but I think it's just coming in at number four because it's the most practical one on the list, guys, and the most easiest to add to the game. So, but personally, I don't really see a big use for it that much in my situation, but you guys might see a use for it in at number three and this is where it gets really interesting we got the smelting potion guys brewed by the builder himself this potion adds five levels to all hero equipment for one hour works in the home village this is definitely maximum capacity five this is definitely a potion we do need guys guys you get you already buff your heroes with the hero potion you use power potion on your troops and then you have those weak hero equipment guys we need this guys we need this and i please guys share this video so super so i can see this guys because this is definitely a huge thing that we would need in the game guys we're able to max out every single thing on our base once we go to a higher town hall with potions but we can't max out hero equipment so with this potion this would help us guys being the fact that we already are always short on ore they are improving that but um this would help 
temporarily for the shortage on ore, guys. And I think this is why it deserves to be in the top three spot, baby. What do you all think about it, guys? Comment down below. Let me know. Number two, we have the hammer of smithing, guys. Uh, a swing of this hammer will instantly upgrade any any piece of hero equipment by two levels work in the home village i do only one holding capacity guys i do like this and my reason for liking this is that it upgrades uh, your equipment by two if it was one i would feel like it wouldn't be worth it worth it as a hammer but it upgrades it by two guys i think this would be definitely rare only found in the league metal shop guys but it is a very interesting idea of making us be able to catch up with our hero equipment guys i think that's that's how um far everyone is behind with hero equipment guys and these little small changes the number three option the number two would help us get that regain guys i'm currently town 11 and my strongest uh hero equipment is like level seven level eight guys and i've been playing the game so you know that there is a gap for how far people all right, the viewers or players hero equipment is behind guys so i do think stuff like this would help improve that gap would help decrease that gap and help us to get further uh maxing out our hero equipment guys because we ain't spending money we're broke all right guys so coming in at number one and this is why i went with this guys because i feel like this would be amazing so we got the ore jar, jar. I butchered that one. Twist this valuable jar opens to instantly fill all of your ore storages by 25%. Works in the home village. I don't know what other village it'll work with, but it works in the home village, guys. And the reason why I do like this one, because I feel like it's so feasible just by filling 25%, not too much guys maximum capacity too i do like the simple idea of this guys because it's so hard to get starry or it's so hard to get um glowy or something even every single or it's so hard to get so by filling 25 percent i would feel like that's a good balance 50 percent would be too op but 25 percent is so balanced it's more than doable guys i think we should share this video let supercell see this guys and also comment down below which one of these magic items would you like to see in the game more i'm your i'm sleeping with your mom tonight and i'm out of here bro peace